Hey guys, Justin here. We're here to look at the fleet state or the runaway state. Let's go to our NBC sample behavior component. Here is the fleet settings. Again, we have universal options right here above and unique options down below. Flee distance is the maximum distance that the AI will flee to. The flee transition is the state that the AI will change to once it finishes running away. So to make this AI run away, let's set the initial behavior to flee, then flee distance to 1000, and flee transition to idle. One thing to note again, if you click on the flee behavior config, in the target tags, you, see, you can see here it's set to player. So that means that this AI will run away from the player. Hit compile. Again, make sure that your player character has a tag of player. Right here, an actor tag of player. Now let's hit play. As you can see, the AI run away from the player character. Now let's say that we want the AI to run away once it sees the player. So what we want to do is go to the idle settings. Here in the idle settings, let's put a let's add an on-site trigger. Uh, when it's let's put a player to the actor tag and the behavior to to flee. Let's set the initial behavior to idle. Hit compile. So basically, what this means is during the idle state, once it sees an actor with a tag of player, it will go to the flee behavior. So let's play this. If we move to the vision, the AI starts to run away. If we move again, if we move again, it runs away. So that is the flee state. 